Hey guys and welcome back to my channel. So today I'm going to be doing my July favorites and I'm just going to jump right in because I don't want to be rambling on a lot and yeah, so just keep watching. Okay, so my first favorite of the month is a beauty favorite and this is a blush palette that I got off Amazon and I will find the link um, of the blush palette and I will put it in the link below but this is just what it looks like and I think, I don't even know how much it was, one, two, three, four. I don't know, there's four blushes in each rose and there's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven rows. So yeah, you get a lot of blushes and the blushes are really, really pretty. I love them. And I just find like these colors are really, really pigmented as well. I love that color actually. The color like, this is really, really dark. I love this color. I'll actually swatch it. Here, I'll show you. This is easier. I'll show you on my finger. That's what it looks like right there. So they're pretty pigmented. I love them. I just rubbed it on my thumb. So the colors are really, really pigmented. And the, for the price, I think it was like $5.99. I got this palette for like $5.99 or $6.99. And that's a really, really good price because it has like a highlighter shade right here as well that I use. And I really, really like all of these colors. I just think they're super pretty. Okay, and my next favorite of the month is this Blushed Nudes Maybelline palette. And this one's like one of the newer ones that they have. They have like the smokes, um, the nudes, the brights, and the blush, um, the blush nudes. I have the nudes, the smokes, and I have this one now. I really need to get the brights, but this one right here has been my favorite for the last month just because it has super, super pretty colors in it, and I will show you guys what I'm talking about. These colors are just super, super pretty. I love this one and this one, and the packaging itself is like no other. I just really, really love this packaging. It is beautiful, and it's like a rose, kind of like a rose gold. I don't know. I just really, really like the packaging that they did for this palette. Okay, so my next favorite of the month is a definite favorite for me. Um, my boyfriend actually went out shopping for me, and I didn't know, and he came home with a surprise for me. And I actually got um, this palette as well from him. My boyfriend actually bought this palette for me, and that, I thought that was really, really cute that he even remembered that I wanted this palette. So, but this palette he did buy me, and this has been a favorite for me for the last month. And this is an Urban Decay uh, Naked 2 Basics palette. But it is just beautiful. I love this. I'm just finally getting around on the bandwagon and buying this. This I don't know. This is just way overdue. But I cannot believe he got me this. And the packaging is just so cute. And when I take out the packaging, this is what it looks like. The Naked palette. It's pretty, pretty small. I'd say it's smaller than my face. And just, just these colors have been my favorite the past month. My favorite color is um, Skimp and... I don't know, maybe cover? I don't know, skimp and cover maybe, or um, primal maybe. This color is really, really pretty as well. They're really, really pigmented. It comes with a huge mirror as well, so you can basically like see everything. But I'm just so grateful for this palette that my boyfriend actually bought me this and the Maybelline's palette. That he actually remembered what palette I wanted. I think that was just super, super cute. If you're watching this, I love you so much and thank you for the gifts. Okay, and another favorite of the month for me was this CoverGirl Outlast Day Fabulous 3-in-1 Foundation. And this is um, an oldie but a goodie for me. I've used this foundation for a long time before, but I just recently started using it again. And I am in... What am I in? I'm in ivory and it has SPF in it as well. This foundation is cheap as well. It's from the drugstore, so it's totally worth it. And this is what it looks like. You guys don't know what it looks like. A lot of people know what it looks like already because it's been out for so long. But it's such an like it's such a good foundation that even if it's like an oldie, it's such a goodie. I love this foundation so much. Okay, and the next favorite of the month for me was this Rimmel Stay Matte Primer. And a lot of people do not like this primer actually. And when I got it, I was like, no, this is not gonna be good. Like no one liked it. But it was on sale for like $7 something like that at my um, local shopper, so I got it. And I actually really love this primer. This is what it looks like. And I don't even know if there's, there's no certain colors, I don't think. I'm in 003, if that makes any difference. But this primer has been so, so good to me and like so good to my skin. I actually really like this primer. It actually hides a lot of my kind of like imperfections on my face. And I don't know, this just keeps me matte all day. I know it didn't work for some people and some people it worked for them. So this definitely works for me. I really like this primer and it's drugstore. I got these three sprays and I got Peach Bellini. I love this scent so much. And this is Plumeria, if I'm saying that right. 
And this is Country Apple. And I really, really like these sprays. My favorite spray has to be this one. And it is the Plumeria. I don't even know if I'm pronouncing that right. And it was really, really amazing that they were on for 3 for 10. I thought that was just so good. And I've already lost two of the lids off of them. And I only have one more left. I always seem to lose the lids off my sprays. I don't know why. Okay, so that is all for my favorites of the month of July. We are on to August now, and I will be making a lot more videos in August. I'm actually going on vacation on this Friday. This video won't be uploaded probably until tomorrow. It is Tuesday today, so this video might be uploaded Wednesday or Thursday. I will try my hardest to edit this and upload it. That So I won't be making any videos that entire week, but I will be vlogging when I'm there. I'm going to Florida. And this is um, not the first time I've gone to Florida, but I'm really, really excited to go to Florida. So I will definitely be vlogging for you guys when I'm there. But I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I will talk to you guys in my next video. Bye guys.